here i am with uh, yet another video and today we are going to talk about uh, you know the situation is changed i was going to talk about whether you should buy a 5g phone or not but honestly in 6 months time it's become topsy turvy the way i looked at 5g phones 6 months back at the start of the year if you would have asked me and i have done a video on our hindi channel whether you should buy 5g or you should stick with 4g right now in that video i said that it depends i mean you can go for 4g or 5g phone depending on your requirement how long you uh, use a particular smartphone but today the situation is changed just 6 months down the line when this year started, started i said uh, you know at that time there were no 5g phones below 20000 rupees and i thought that by the end of 2021 we will see phones which are between 15 and 20000 but just within 6 months that is from jan to june we already have multiple phones that are not only below 20000 but also below 15000 and i'll tell you what with the pace we are going i think we will probably by the end of 2021 we will see a 5g smartphone in india for less than 10000 there are already rumors that uh, realme c series is going to get 5g uh, connectivity or 5g smartphones and c series are generally below 10000 in fact they are 7 8 9000 price range imagine if you are getting a 5g in that price range i mean there is no reason earlier there was a reason because 5g phone were expensive the price differential between a 4g phone and a 5g phone was very large not now i mean you look at a 4g phone and 5g phone with the same spec the price differential would be not more than 1000 or 2000 rupees and generally if you look at the uh, usage of a smartphone by average user definitely he uses it for not less than one and a half years about 18 months i promise you that in india in next 18 months you are definitely going to see 5g network also when i made these videos about 6 months back i was only looking at 5g network when it is going to come whether it is going to come uh, year down the line year and half down the line at this point of time the way smartphone market has evolved i think it's a no brainer you should go for a 5g smartphone let's talk a bit about um, when 5g is going to arrive in india from what i have seen read spoken to industry people i can tell you by this day next year you will have a few cities that will have 5g connectivity yes i am not saying that it is going to be pan india because the rollout is going to be in a phased manner also when 5g rolls out 4g is going to be there 5g is not going to replace 4g 4G will be there and parallelly you will also have 5G and that thing is going to go on for at least 3 4 years 4G is not going to die off so it's not that you have a 4G phone right now so right now you should buy a 5G phone or 6 months down the line you should buy a 5G phone 4G connectivity will still remain now let's look at smartphones 5G chipsets are generally newer chipsets. In fact, if you look at chip manufacturers right now, they are not coming up with 4G chipsets anymore. All the chipsets or 4G chipsets which are there, whether it is in uh, 6 or 7 series or 8 series, they are at least 6 months or older. And I'll always say, try to buy the newest chipset possible because it is just not about connectivity, it is about all the other things because chipset is system on chip. Yeah, it's about imaging, it is about your modem, it is is about your connectivity and it is about ai and everything else the newest 5g chipsets are actually very good in ai because ai is growing like crazy ai has become the main focus for newer chipsets so again for that reason you should look at 5g only you know i see a lot of people talking uh, on social media commenting that you know 5g is nowhere we don't know when it is going to come we don't know what the bands are going to be and all those things my reasoning for buying a 5g phone is not at all about whether we have a 5g network whether it is going to come in year or so it is about the phones you are buying like i said chipsets are newer the technology is new the fabrication process is on 7 nm 5 nm 6 nm and the older chipsets are on probably 8 nm or 12 nm 4g chipset so from every aspect right now it's not about 4g 5g it's all about buying the best smartphone and incidentally all the best smartphones are 5g smartphones before ending this video i have to tell you a couple of things first thing is airtel Jio, our telecom networks, even we for that matter, Vodafone Idea, they are all testing their 5G network right now. In fact, uh, a lot of uh, telecom uh, operator executives have already gone ahead and said that once the spectrum is allocated, we are in a position to quickly roll out 5G. So you know, people saying that no, it's going to take a lot of time. No, it is not. I do not think so. Like I've said earlier in the video, it's matter of not more than a year. Bottom line. 
buy a 5G phone. Yeah, and I wanted to do this video because just six months back when I did a video on our Hindi channel and even on Marathi, I have said that, you know, it depends on you. Now, at this point of time, it does not. You just go ahead with a 5G phone. That's about it in this video. If you liked it, make sure you hit that like button. And if you want to get more videos and be notified when we upload a video, ensure that you hit that uh, subscribe button along with that bell icon. That's about it in this video. Until next time, keep tracking and stay safe.